Hey everybody, welcome back to Nerdvana Reactions. I'm Anna, and today we are checking out Jeff Castellucci's cover of The Reigns of Castamere from Game of Thrones Season 8. Now, I haven't seen... Ooh, I think I left off on Season 5. But, of course, with the whole big scandal over how it ended, I got that spoiled for me, so I haven't gone back and actually finished the series. Um, so I've never actually until last night heard the original of this song. I was really kind of surprised to see that the original vocals were done by Serge Tankian from System of a Down. Um, never been that big of a fan of System of a Down. <laughs> but I'm eager to see what Jeff can do with this. I see he's got his own Iron Throne of sorts. Um, very amazing setup, as always. <laughs> Let's be honest. The theatrics never, ever suffer. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to go ahead and get into this, but if you enjoyed the video, please like, comment, and subscribe. And who are you? The proud lord said that I must bow so low Only a cat of a different coat That's all the truth I know In a coat of gold or a coat of red A lion still has claws As long and sharp as yours, 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 and so he spoke. Okay. So I get from the coat of arms in the background that he's going with the whole Lannister thing. And the lyrics, when I listened to it last night, kind of sounded like they were talking about Tywin. But correct me if I'm wrong. Like I said, I left off on season five. Um, but is the Jeff on the right supposed to be Jamie Lannister? Because the outfit looks kind of like something he would wear. <laughs> And so he spoke, the Lord of Castamere. But now the rains weep o'er his hall with no one there to hear. Yes, now the rains weep o'er his hall with not a soul to Sorry, I will back that up. <laughs> Still a tad bit sick. <laughs> Mostly over it, but occasional coughing to be expected for the next week or so. <laughs>
making me dizzy, Jeff. <laughs> I'm going to back that up five because I can't go through the whole shifting who's in the Iron Throne sequence again, but I feel like I missed the start of a bass drop, and we definitely never want to miss that. <laughs> And so he spoke, the Lord of Castamere, but now the rains weep o'er his hall, with no one there to hear. Now the rains weep o'er his hall, with not a soul. I will keep going. I just need a second. <laughs> okay. So if anyone wants to give me the Game of Thrones backstory on this, go for it. Probably not going to go back and finish the show. It's kind of like Lost once you know the ending. Mm. <laughs> um I was never as hardcore of a Game of Thrones fan as a lot of people anyway. I liked it, but I wasn't, like, in love with it. I am probably, in most cases, a bigger fan of the original books. But I haven't even read those in a long time. Um, I really like Jeff's higher register, and I love that we get to hear a lot of that in his solo work. Those, those really, really bassy, bassy notes, though. <laughs> They never cease to amaze, and you may notice that I usually film with one headphone partially off so that I can keep an ear on my kiddo um, <laughs> when it comes to those notes. Headphones, yeah, gotta go back on all the way, <laughs> just for a few seconds. <laughs> um, all right, I'm going to go ahead and let this play out. But, yeah. I honestly, at the beginning of this, I wasn't sure how he was going to handle that sing-songy bit at the very beginning. But he nailed it. And that shouldn't be surprising. And yet, somehow every bass singer I listen to still manages to regularly surprise me. <sighs> Talk about one talented bunch of people. <sighs> If y'all enjoyed the video, please like, comment, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next one.